Well, sabi dito na secured daw yung card mo kasi it is protected by EMV chip. I don't know what that thing is. Binasa ko lang siya dito and it says it's safe and secure. So, yeah. Yo, so what is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then let me introduce myself first. I am Gabriel Manuel. I make videos about personal growth, finance, and aesthetics. I also upload university vlogs and interviews with people from all walks of life. Interesting? Then like my videos, click that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell for you to stay updated. Alright, let's begin. So in today's video, we'll be talking about this card. This Pag Ibig Loyalty Card Plus. And it says here that it's powered by either Asia United Bank or Union Bank. Yes, we're talking about Pag Ibig this time. So, pass muna tayo sa crypto no ho. Kasi may nagsabi sa akin na yung channel ko raw ay parang nagiging crypto channel na siya. Which, hindi yun ang goal natin. So, yeah, we're going to talk everything about this card and um i guess medyo mahabahabang discussion siya and for you not to waste your time in my videos kasi baka may gusto kang marinig or gusto kang makita sa video ko pero in the first place hindi naman pala covered so ibe break down natin kung anong meron sa video natin ngayon so the first thing we're going to talk is like kung ano yung requirements para ka makakuha nito tapos yung fees kung magkano nga ba ito at saka kung saan ka pwede kukuha nito. And lastly, kung ano yung mga usage nito. Kung ano yung mga perks na pwede nating makuha kapag meron na tayong pag-ibig loyalty card plus. Okay, interested ka pa rin ba? Sige, let's start. But before we start, disclaimer lang. I'm not a financial nor a personal growth advisor. So please don't take my videos as professional advice. All of these are based on my experiences and my researches lang. So, I highly recommend pa rin to do your own research before diving to something completely new to you. Deal? Okay. Let's begin. So, first, this is what a Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus looks like. Yun. Wait. Parang example dito. Eto. So, para siyang ganun. Tapos yung sa likod niya, eh, nandito yung, <laughs> hindi ko kipapakita sa inyo kung ano yung ID number. ID number ba yung tawag dito? <laughs> kung ano yung savings account number ng card ko. Sa parang ganun. Wala kayo nakita, di ba? <laughs> parang nakapakiputa. <laughs> I was curious on why nilagyan nila ng word na Plus, I mean, pwede man tawaging pag-ibig loyalty card lang, ba? Pero bakit may plus? So, I search it on the web and find out na meron palang older version nito. And yung pinagkaiba lang nila is that merong microchip yung bagong pag-ibig loyalty card, which is the pag-ibig loyalty card plus. Kasi yung previous version nila ay wala. I personally find it weird seeing your you know, photo in a card na pwede mong gamitin as cash card. I mean, di ba, unless it's an ID thing, then dapat wala ng picture. Pero eto, merong picture at the same time. Pwede kang maka-withdraw, pwede kang maka-deposit. And also, this card doesn't really look and feel like premium, you know? I mean, if you really look closely into the card itself, hindi mo talaga masasabi na high quality yung card na ginamit. And may nagsabi din sa amin na yung printing company daw na nakontrata ng pag-ibig ng branch na yan ay hindi masyadong maganda yung service na pinoprovide. Which means that there's a possibility na iba yung kalidad ng card from this branch compared sa quality ng card from this branch. Pero basta, you know, to be honest, my Minisky Infinity card, yung Pondo card ko, ay mas nagmukha pang classy, mas nagmukha pang premium compared to this card. So, ngek. <laughs> Pero, you know, as what they say, na don't judge a book by its cover. So, 
Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's proceed na talaga. So, ano-ano nga ba yung requirements before you can avail this card? First, you need to be an active Pag-ibig member na merong at least 600 na contribution sa regular savings mo. When I applied, sinabihan ako ng staff na I'm not qualified pa to avail this loyalty card. Since ang laman ng Pag-ibig savings account ko ay 200 pesos pa lang. Well, 100 per month lang talaga yung nilagay ko. <laughs> so, yun nga, kulang daw yung contribution ko. Kaya I asked him, you know, I asked the staff kung pwede ba akong magbayad ng additional 400 sa Gcash ko. And glad to say, nag yes naman siya. Pero sabi niya na baka sa ibang branches daw ay hindi kayo papayagan kasi it will take 2 to 3 working days para ma-process yung payment mo. Pero yung hiningi lang niya sa akin is like, yung resibo ng payment ko sa GCash. So, suggestion na lang na before kayo mag-apply for this loyalty card, eh dapat magbayad na kayo ng at least 600 sa contribution nyo in advance para, you know, less hassle, less stress na yung pagdadaanan nyo upon getting this card, you know? So, if you're already an active pag-ibig member na merong at least 600 pesos sa regular savings account mo, then after that, hingan kanila ng one valid government issued ID. In my case, nag-provide ako ng postal ID ko. So, kung hindi kailangan ang government issued ID upon opening a pag-ibig account, well, sa yung loyalty card mo, needed na siya. So, after nun, pipicturean ka nila together with your government issued ID. Tapos, a separate photo will be taken as the photo na gagamitin nila, na ilalagay nila sa card mo. Which in my case, ang pangit ko. Maybe, ang pangit lang talaga ng camera nun. Pangit lang talaga ako. So, yun nga. Natapos ka na lang picture and After nun, they will ask both of your thumb marks para ilagay nila sa system nila. And then, you need to wait for at least 5 to 15 minutes para i-print nila yung ID mo before you can proceed to the payment section. Doon ka magbabayad ng 125 pesos as your ID fee. Kasi sabi nila na yung service daw nila is free na daw. So, yung ID lang yung babayaran mo. But, you know, alam naman natin kung paano nag-work yung business, di ba? Nasali na yan, doon yung service nila. Then after nun, voila! Meron ka ng pag-ibig loyalty card plus hinayupak ka. <laughs> I hope you guys are getting my reference. You know, it's a vine from a five-minute craft na nilagyan ng Tagalog dub. Basta, I guess, nakita nyo na yan. At voila! Tingnan natin kung matutupi mo pa yung salamin hayop ka. So, ito yung makukuha mo upon leaving the branch. Una yung Union Bank envelope na kung saan nandito yung resibo ng card na binayaran mo. A piece of paper that contains... Nope, dapat din yung makita. Basta, a piece of paper that contains, you know, your PIN, your savings account number, stuff like that. And a generic letter from Pag-ibig that congratulates you for having your loyalty card plus. And dito na rin nakalagay yung card mo. So, why generic, Gab? Well, you know, congratulations. We are pleased to present you your new Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus, which will serve not as a blah, 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 Pag-ibig fan. So, yun yung laman ng Union Bank envelope. Aside sa envelope, you can also receive this two booklet sort of thing na kung saan yung una nakalagay dito yung short term loan online application a step by step guide so yan well in my case since hindi pa ako maglo loan so hindi ko to kailangan and yung isa ay everything about the perks ng loyalty card plus mo here you can find their national partners such as to go air 21 boss coffee dhl hbc human nature mcdonald's oh mcdonald's here we go petron pure gold STI, Time Zone, Rasta Lopez, and such. And meron din silang listahan ng mga local partners nila. You know, actually, ang rami nilang partners, guys, like 
more than 100 yung nakalagay dito. Tapos, sinabi pa sa last part na marami pa silang partners na darating in the near future. Which is a good thing. So, how it works nga ba? I mean, the perks thing with their partners, you know? Okay. So, halimbawa, um, sa Rusty Lopez. Saan nga yun? Okay. Ito sa Rusty Lopez. It says here that um, you can avail a 10% discount for a minimum purchase of 1,000 pesos and a 20% discount for a minimum purchase of 3,000 pesos. So, all you need to do is like, kapag magbabayad ka na ng binili mong sapatos or belt sa, or whatsoever, sa Rusty Lopez, ay ipresent mo lang yung pag-ibig loyalty card plus ID mo. And after that, Voila! May discount ka na. Wait, Gab, di ba sabi mo that that new Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus works like an ATM card? Yes! So, ano ngayon? Well, okay lang ba na magbigay ka ng access sa any stores? Like, you know, they can use your card. Well, sabi dito na secured daw yung card mo kasi it is protected by EMV chip. I don't know what that thing is. Binasa ko lang siya dito and it says it's safe and secure. So, yeah. Salig na lang ito, no? What salig nga? Um, basta, you know, just trust. Trust them, okay? So, aside from having big discounts with their partnered companies, well, you can withdraw or deposit from this card since it is connected na from your Union Bank account. Nakuha ko to last March 24th, 2020 and up until now, hindi ko pa ito natatry and hindi ko pa ito nagagamit. So, I can't really say pa kung gano'n ka smooth or gano'n ka ganda or kung gano'n ka pangit yung service na kaya nilang i-offer. But if you want me guys to make a separate video for that, then just leave your message in the comment section down below for me to read that and para na rin magawa natin ito ng separate video soon, okay? So, yun nga, final verdict na tayo about this new Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus. Okay, I'm so sorry guys, I always keep looking into this card kasi hindi ko memorize yung five words na Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus. Well, the word Pag-ibig seems like one word lang kasi may dash siya. Okay, the, the four words, Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus, Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus, Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus. Okay, yeah, final verdict about this Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus. Oh, na-memorize ko na. Okay. Personally, I like the perks. I mean, malaking discounts yung pinag-uusapan natin dito. 5 to 20% discount is way, way, way better compared sa walang discount at all. I mean, kahit a little discount compared to no discount, dito pa rin ako sa may discount. Tapos the fact na pwede mo siyang gamitin as a regular ATM card and at the same time, a valid identification card, then it's a win-win na talaga. Well, sabi kasi ng pag-ibig staff na this is, oops, nalaglag. This is already a valid ID, but um, hindi ko pa alam if it is recognized nationwide na. So, it's better pa rin na magdala ka ng passport mo or ng postal ID mo or ng driver's license in kaso na hindi nila ito tatanggapin as valid ID. So, Everything is sulit and everything is great, nice, you know, except sa card mismo. Kasi I personally, yun nga, sabi ko kanina na hindi siya that premium, hindi siya that quality, hindi mo mafe-feel yung like, I don't know if you guys ay merong crypto card na aluminum, mga parang ganun. I'm not saying na they should go to aluminum as well. What I'm saying is like, at least they can compete in terms of quality with my Minisk Infinity card. Minisk pa rin. But anyway, aside from the card itself, and dito yung perks. Okay, pangit lang yung card. Pero maybe daw sa ibang branches, maganda yung card nila. So, yeah. I would highly recommend, I would highly suggest pa rin to get your Pag-ibig Loyalty Card Plus now. I was like, for me, it's a great investment. So yeah, that ends up our video for today. If you enjoy or learn something from my video, then please feel free to hit that like button. 
subscribe on my channel, click the notification bell, and leave your comments in the comment section down below. Because like, by doing that, makakatulong talaga kayo sa YouTube algorithm ko. And also, meron na referral codes sa description down below, especially for PDAX, Shopbox, Paymaya, Union Bank, and Gcash. Sana gamitin nyo yun kasi like, it's a win-win thing din naman. Meron kayong free and meron din ako free. And if you guys want to know more about me, then feel free to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I make updates there almost every day. Thank you so much guys for watching and sana subaybayan nyo pa ako sa future journey ng buhay ko. Bye! God bless everyone! And yung isa ay everything. Oh, birds, come on. Will you please stop chirping? Stop. And a generic congratulatory. You know, if you can remember my previous pag-ibig video, kung saan sinabi ko na pwede ka maka-open ng account sa pag-ibig for as low as 100 pesos per month. Well, yun yung ginawa ko. Naglagay lang ako ng 100 pesos per month. So, two months pa lang ako since nagkaroon ako ng pag-ibig. So, yeah, basically, kulang pa talaga. I mean, puta. Yo, so what is up, guys? Sabah, oi.